can taste both of them now. We actually started to see more sunshine and kind of ending what will be kind of a nice day. We had mostly cloudy skies. Some early, early morning showers only picked up another two hundredths of an inch at Kenner during the early morning hours. 69 degrees is our current temperature, and that is the high for the day. We're in the 60s on both sides of the lake. Kind of that late sunshine really started to warm temperatures up. So our high is actually exactly where we're supposed to be. And temperatures this morning were on the milder side, but we are going to be getting colder over the next couple of days. Morning temperatures stayed in the 50s, then got into the 60s at uh, 10 a.m. And again, once we started to get more of that sunshine, those highs got into the more upper 60s. And now as the sun is going down, temperatures will begin to drop. And we are expecting kind of a chilly couple of mornings with maybe some frost on the North Shore by wake up time on Saturday. Winds are still fairly breezy, although they will be settling down by tomorrow. But another front is on the way by early in the morning. And what that front is going to do is really more than anything kind of reinforce the cooler, dry air that's in place and also help to keep the winds up through the early part of the day tomorrow. Then I think winds will start to settle as we get later in the day on Friday. A couple of little upper disturbances our models have been indicating may try and keep a few clouds around during the day on Friday and then also maybe a little bit more cloudiness at times during the day on Saturday. Overall weekend is going to be very nice, but I do think we're going to see at least partly cloudy skies as we head into the day Saturday and then more so on Sunday as golf moisture starts to return. These little cool snaps don't last for very long. I was talking about frost on the North Shore. That is not tonight. We'll be in the 40s and 50s with clearing skies and breezy conditions. Tomorrow afternoon, high temperatures will likely stay more in the lower 60s as we have that next front on the way. Then in our seven day forecast, we will be pretty chilly on Saturday morning. Again, some frost possible north of the lake. Remember our time change Saturday night. More of a return flow from the Gulf sending temperatures back into the 70s. We could be near 80 degrees warmer, more humid by next week.